at this place. It's boring, right? Something is tickling. <laughs> what if it was super scary? A hundred times worse. With scary places, creepy monsters, and predators lurking in the night. Where are the kids? That's what I'm gonna find out today. By playing Stalker. That's what the mask is. One day when I already found myself in a tricky situation, the game dropped me off in the middle of nowhere with limited supplies. <laughs> Bread. Later I met this guy who told me that I was in fact not in Chernobyl, but near Pripyat. They call it Zaton. He wanted to lead me to the nearest safe place, but things got crazy. Looks like we have some company, boys. But don't worry. We got this. I don't know what to say. They were coming from everywhere. Oh no, they are attacking us. Oh no. Unbelievable. <laughs> After I looted their bodies, I noticed that I had markers on my map. These were my main quests. The Stingrays. Five military helicopters that crashed for mysterious reasons. My task is to investigate. And nothing can stop me from touching those helicopters. Ladies and gentlemen, I cannot go any further. <laughs> The chopper is surrounded by toxic chemicals and it's killing me. <laughs> that was because I forgot about the one thing that my parents forgot about when they were making me. Protection. And where should I get armor from? Like what? But I remembered what my great friend said to me. The nearest safe place. Okay, there must be a person who sells armor here, right? Hi guys, I'm just passing by. Hey, what's up? This place smells like piss. Eventually I found a guy who sold the items I needed. But there was a catch. 15,000? Are you insane? Since I was low on money, I asked people around for a job, but nobody wanted to talk to a stranger. Where can I get a job? The fog is coming, okay. Okay, whatever man. Luckily this generous bald man offered me a job, and now I'm here in the middle of the night, about to kill people. Okay, this? This is getting very exciting right now. Bravo 6, going dark. This was the point where I got my first slap in the face from the game. Because I rushed in like an idiot. Let's do it! Yeah, please! Let's go! Oh my god! Oh my god! Everything went smoothly after that. <laughs> and I didn't restart the quest many times at all. Are you kidding me? I just killed my teammate. What are you doing? Okay, those were just team rearrangements. I got a nice cut at the end and sat by the fire for a couple of minutes. This is Peak Stalker, guys. How do you even manage to capture this feeling? Wow. On day two, I went back to the gentle bald man to make more money and took part in a transaction process at the ranger station. Okay, this is epic. We are just walking. <laughs> Bro, I'm just standing there in nothing. Oh my god. That turned out to be an ambush instead. <laughs> wow. In the middle of looting the corpses, something strange happened. Bro, everything got super dark. Like, look at this. What have you done? You're breaking the matrix! <laughs> Which is basically the zone farting big energies from the sky in an unpredictable schedule. Like everything gets super dark and if you stay outside you die. Ah! And also, that's when they appear. Who are you? What do you want from me? After getting my cut, nice. I went back to Skadovska and bought the gas mask. One item done. One more to go. Getting money for the armor was a terrible process. <laughs> but bear with me. He's behind me, isn't he? It all started with the man who sold me bread. <laughs> Boldman number two. He sent me to the dress station. Something is glowing up there. For this thing. Ew, is this like a hentai thing? An artifact. Which is basically a power-up for stalkers. You can find these things around anomalies using a detector. And if you sell them, you can make a ton of money. But since they are expensive, 
you are never the only one looking for them. Brother, listen, there is this artifact. Nope, haven't seen it. Just you keep walking. You'll remember this moment, that's for sure. I mean, what was he thinking? Coming at me alone? Come on, man. I would rather not talk about that, okay? After selling the artifact and the Nokia 360 I found earlier, it wasn't enough. <sighs> I was still short on money. However, on day 4 I got that bread, if you know what I mean. You know what I mean, right? You know? But before that, I wanted to patch myself up. So I went to the medic, Tremor. His medical skills were impressive, but his personality? Not so much. It felt like he was sucking the blood out of my body. Like, like eating my flesh. It's almost like this dude loves eating humans. The dog gave me so much ibuprofen, I had to lay down and sleep. But on day four, it was time to get that bread. That's where Grouse came into the picture, with the crazy mission I told you earlier. Okay, so a stalker named Danila went missing, and Grouse thinks it was the bloodsuckers. Is bloodsuckers like a football team or something? To find that out, I went to the Krug Antenna Complex. Brother, what happened to you? Guys, this is the bloodsuckers place. Like, this is where they play Call of Duty and stuff. What the fuck? There's something there. <laughs> what, what the hell is that, man? What the hell is that? This doesn't look like Ronaldo, man. <laughs> no, don't go down there. Don't go. See, I told you. I told you not to do it. Jesus. No, don't go down there. Bad grouse. Bad grouse. Shh. It's full of sleeping bloodsuckers. You gotta be kidding me, man. <laughs> well, that was funny. Bro, these things creep me out so bad. He's kind of chill, though. Hey, there is the chopper. I'm coming for you, baby. On the other note, I don't want to come back here at all. Unfortunately, this wasn't the last time I had to come here. Because on day 5 I went to get something that could kill these monsters. What do you think? What is a great weapon against a group of individuals that is only causing problems to you? That's right. Guess. So I went to the bridge and found a container in a military safe. It was 10 kilos making me unable to move, but after eating 5 kilos of bread, I could go back to the complex and put the gas in its place. Guys, don't worry, I know what I'm doing. I saw everything on History Channel. As you know, I came to the zone to test my survival skills. But man... After turning that valve, my confidence completely disappeared. Hey, what's up? Ready for round two? Come on, come on. Oh my god, there's three of them! Okay, I just gotta concentrate, man. What is that damage? Oh my god! I swear, this feels like a schizophrenic attack, man. Overall, I died 23 times. Yeah, that's crazy, I know. But we are here... I don't know. <laughs> and if that wasn't enough, the payout was disappointing as well. You gotta be kidding me, man. After not being able to live with my own failure, I spent the next day searching for a place where I could hang myself up. That seems like a good place. However... As I approached the place, I found something bad. <gasps> this is Danila, the missing stalker. <laughs> I forgot your name. <laughs> Turns out this guy killed all the missing stalkers and not the bloodsuckers. Because of... <laughs> Hemoglobin <laughs> addiction. <laughs> what? Wait, wait, wait. Don't do it. We have GTA 6 trailer. That was the lamest self-execution I have ever seen. He also killed Grouse. I told you to not go down there, but you just didn't listen. I went back to Skadovs to tell everyone what happened. You guys are gonna sh** yourselves. And got so much money, oh my god, oh my god. <laughs> Seeing this, I immediately rushed to the other bald man on the second floor and purchased the armor. Yes, Jesus. This took way too long. And I also had some spare money left. Guys, should I buy the RPG? I don't know man. I will do it later, okay? I gotta go to the chopper first. When I got to the first chopper, I realized that this game is a never-ending nightmare. Bro, it's the goddamn bloodsuckers again. Leave me alone! Ah! I lost all hope in myself. 
But I didn't come here to cry every time I die. I didn't want to throw this opportunity down a cliff like it's a newborn child. Did I just say that? I came here to survive. <laughs> come on, boy. <laughs> What's up, boys? You wanna dance? You wanna dance? Come at me, man. After I killed all the 3,000 volatiles, I mean, bloodsuckers, I investigated the chopper. Hmm. This is not a horse. And with that, our first heli was done. Four more to go. Woo! To celebrate my first investigated chopper, I drank with my new best friend, Hardan. You wouldn't believe how much I have in common with this dude. Like, being an alcoholic. <clears throat> On day 8 it was time for the second chapter. Another day, another victory for the OG. But it was unreachable. Ah! So I found the man who used the dark magic <laughs> to lead me there. So this is where the dude leaves, huh? Interesting. Hello, is the IRS? Peace off! Dude! What? The flip. I mean, I'm not mad at you. I would have the same reaction. <laughs> Meeting Noah was pretty weird. First he showed me his cute dog, then he disappeared into the void. Noah is a weird kid, man. But hey, I followed him and I was at the chopper. This is an epic gamer moment. This place was quiet. A bit too quiet. Guys, look, I found evacuation points. Look, look. I can finally get out of here. Wait, what was that? I just got shot at, bro. I just cannot catch a break in Stalker, man. Where are they? Oh, there you go. There you go. Bro, they are in the trees. I feel like I'm in Vietnam. What the? And what is this? Oh my god. Nice. I'm getting shot at and getting killed by Tarzan. That's just amazing. <laughs> okay, you wanna play? Then let's play. Fortnite. Uh, I actually killed all of them. <laughs> The people with the guns turned out to be a group named the Manalit. They will cause a lot of problems later. And the jumping things with a penis on their face were vape addicts. They were looking for their vapes. <laughs> I'm so funny, I'm dead, bro. Is this funny? Before I could end my day and prepare myself for the next chopper. Another day, another chopper hits the tower. This guy told me something I wasn't ready for. They tracked down a chimera. A dangerous predator lurking in the night, looking for kids. And I had the best idea for the job. Whoever said money cannot buy happiness was an idiot. <laughs> I slept for a couple of hours and at 3 a.m. it was time for the boys to go chimera hunting. Oh man, I cannot wait to use this thing. I bet you can't do this in Fortnite. Guys, I located the target. My top G is the RPG. It's over. The job is done. Yeah! This time I was lucky. I just pulled an Abraham Lincoln and shot him from behind. Yeah! But I wasn't so lucky at the third crash site. It was at the Iron Forest Anomaly where the game introduced a new type of enemy. The Shadow Wizard Money Gang. They love casting spells. Especially taking away my motherfucking guns. <laughs> oh man, what is this? Oh, I want to get out of here, man. I investigated the chopper and found something that changed my life forever. A map that showed me a way out of this dangerous place. I gave it to this guy and he led me out of the zone. Into an even crazier one. <laughs> yeah, no. Oh man, I cannot wait to explore this place. Maybe I will pick some flowers. <laughs> make new friends. Bro, watch out! Oh my god! And just have fun, you know. It will be fun. Right? <laughs> Hey, YouTube thinks you would like this video. Just click it. You know, trust me. Just click it. <laughs>